Yo, what's up YouTube, PK here, welcome to Fire Cape from Scratch, episode 8. That sounds crazy that I've made 8 episodes, all perfect episodes, might I add. No, I'm joking. Anyways, I've mined 244 mithril ore, I'll show you my list here. I've mined that much mithril ore and that much coal, so I need a time set by 4 to get how much coal I can actually um, make. So I need to um, get roughly almost close to a thousand coal now. Um, so that's fine, it will level my mining once more, I don't know if it will get 64 or not, but um, I started the series at 60 mining I believe, so now that is crazy. Sorry guys about that last clip, I was meant to have 216 before, I accidentally added 28 coal in to this instead of this, so that is 28 more, so that is 48 now, so yeah, now I'm going back for another 28. Oh yeah, just got a diamond. More um diamond bolts E. Holy shit, that's the first I've seen of one of them in here. Holy shit, it's actually throwing things at me. Okay, I think this is the one. Here we go. Come on. It's just a piece of coal. Um sixty-three mines, that's awesome. And how many uh, seven hundred and seventy coal, so a few more to go. But to be honest, it actually hasn't taken that long. I would say about five hours in total. And I have done it. These last 28 coal, coal make my thing 854, 216 myth. So I believe I have enough coal. I'm, I hope. Let me just double check. So we go 216 times 4 equals 864. So I need another 10. Okay. Okay, so before I turn these all into bars, I need to see exactly how many I can make. So as we can see here, go to here, we have 854 coal, divide that by 4, which makes 213, I have 216, so I can do, make 213. Now I did some researching that mithril swords are actually the best to make, as they only require one bar to make each, and they elk for 500. Um, but, uh, if I times that by, yeah, they elk for 507. So that ends me with 107k, so that is uh, awesome. So actually just looking at my XP here, and we are 2k away, so 1.8k. So we're definitely going to level just by doing uh, these mithril things. And then I get to turn them into swords. This is the inventory. It's going to happen. Three, two... I don't know if it's this one or this one. Oh, there we go, 55. That means I can make mithril scimitars. It doesn't really matter because a mithril skimmy takes two bars. Okay, so I've just finished smithing 211 mithril bars. So now we're going to go to Varrock and smith them all into mithril swords. But also, I need to. Uh, I'm not finished with mining, by the way. I need to mine some more pure S, so I need, um, I've got 75 pure S, and I've got, I'm um, just looking at my list, 77 nature rune, that doesn't seem right, does it? Well, I have to check uh, from my last episode. Okay, so I just realized I forgot to take away the ones that I'd used, so I had 77 and I used 63 last time, so I have 14 left. So let me just quickly change that to 14, and now I need to go mine uh, some purists. Uh, see guys, even though I have like, let's see, 36k pure S, I still have to mine it from scratch, of course. Now for the fun part of making 200 uh, nature runes, now I have to do 30 at a time, and, or not 30 at a time because I need some runes for teleporting, but um... I need to run back to Edgeville like five times or so, um, so that's going to be fun. Uh, so I finish my trip and then I go to Varrock and then repeat the process over and over until I have 210 nature runes, which I'm pretty close now. Uh, right now I have, let's have a look, where's my nature, is it 152, and if you see my calculator here, and I press enter, that adds 27, so I have 179 now. Okay, so I'm getting really annoyed with this Christmas tree actually. It's after Christmas, so it should be removed. I don't know why it's still there. But uh, 179, and we're just another 27. Oh, it puts me on 206, but I think that might be enough. If I times that by 507 each, and that is enough, so that's fine. Uh, I need 206 nature room, so that's all cool. Uh, I just finished making them all, and I'm 3k away from my next smithing level, so it's not too far. 
not too hard to do so now time to elk all these bad boys this guy here is throwing pretty friggin snowballs at me what the hell is up with that man oh yes and if you guys are interested in my um in real life sort of stuff because i was going to make an unboxing video uh for my ps4 when it got here now the thing is, um, I brought, uh, well, the thing is with PS4 is you have to pre-order it to get it. You can't just go in straight on the Boxing Day sales where it, when I went and freaking just buy one with straight up cash like I was going to. Um, you have to pre-order them online and the shipment uh, comes early next January. So I won't get my um, PS4 for like another week or so yet. So I don't, I'm not sure exactly when it's coming. But uh, I'm still going to be making that video, so expect an unboxing video soon. But there's another sort of surprise in that video as well. So that's going to be awesome to make when you guys see that. Oh, two more Alks for that white cash stack, guys. One more to go. And boom, 100k gold from scratch. That is awesome. And I have something even better to show you. Watch this. And a couple more Alks, I believe. Maybe one more. Maybe one more. 75 magic, guys. That is just awesome. That's for Fire Wave. And I can wear this off of the dead. That's it. That's cool. Not like I'm going to get one of them, but uh, 75 magic. What's that? Three levels? This one video? Oh my god. This is more of a skilling series rather than a from scratch series. Okay, so now I have the question um, do I need. Uh, one a monkey talisman thing to actually turn me into a monkey so I can buy a uh, dragon skimmy from the shop. Now we're gonna find this out shortly, um, but I'm gonna go here first. So we're gonna find that out shortly, but uh, first let's get to Apatol and uh, see what's going on from there. Okay, so I have been poisoned and that's why I did bring my food and I did pray so hopefully I was meant to bring a one click teleport so that sucks if I can't uh, manage to teleport but we're going to run up here pray range and I believe I get sent to jail if, uh, if I can remember this quest uh, if not then um, yeah so I'm dead and now I'm in jail I believe so take off that, and yep, we're in jail, um, so now I have to sort of escape, and I'll see you guys when I get to the store. Ah, uh, monkey, 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 oh, sure, oh, it's seen me, oh my god. Okay, so we are out of there, now I don't know if I can just run straight there without getting actually, like, caught or anything, but we're gonna try it. Hopefully, uh, I can just run straight over here, straight through, hopefully, let's just keep going. Keep going, and there's a store over here. Go around the back way, I think it's a bit safer. Um, we're getting close. No, I don't know if it's... Wait, is this the guy? I want to get attacked by... Oh, wait, do I need a monkey speak amulet? Really? Can't steal during combat. So I think I do need a monkey speak amulet to actually do this part. Um, yeah, and I died again, so, um, yeah, I'm gonna have to get that. Okay, so I need these monkey dentures, yes, I wish to take them. Now, I believe I need to go get, uh, one gold bar, which I do actually have from scratch, and, uh, one, um, ball of wool. So, uh, let's go. So, I believe somewhere over here in a box, probably here, I think it's right here. Uh, there we go, you take this monkey mold. Now I believe I can go make it monkey speak amulet. Okay, last stage of this amulet, I believe. So we're going to go in here and go down. Hopefully they don't block me. But we go down this little um, trap door here. The guy training his... Um, his uh, I can't actually get in there because they're all fucking blocking me. But anyways... Um, Come on, let me in! Anyway, I'm just going to quickly pray uh, up here, I believe. Pray here, just so I don't run out of prayer. Because these things are friggin' annoying me. And we can't walk around them, so that sucks. Okay, and down here, I believe we go over to this flaming uh, wall of flame. Oh, I believe it's over this way, I can't remember. I thought it was this way. Don't know if I just used this gold bar on the wall of flame or not, but let's give it a go. And uh, we're under attack, so that's not gonna 
end greatly, is it? Okay, so what I didn't realize is but I had to run this whole uh, thingy again, so that's going to be fun, that little uh, chamber where it takes ages and you get poisoned and attacked all the way, and uh, yeah, it's really easy with prayer. But I remember doing this at the um, start of the game when 07 servers first came back without prayer. I think I died roughly like 18 times, so yeah. Okay, I've walked all the way to this guy. Uh, he says we need a gold bar, monkey amulet, mold, and something to do for monkey speech. So you've got all that stuff. So if I go, uh, I'll be back later. And if I talk to him again, do I get to just uh, have to use it on him? Uh, I think I have to use it all on. So if I give him that, he takes that. Good work. Give him this. Good work, give him this. Good work, and give him this. Nothing interesting happens. Now what? Oh, I have to wait a moment. And there we go, he gave me a, um, a bar, so I'll be back later, and I believe I turned that bar into something else, so uh, yeah. Okay, so the very last part of this, I have to run in here, pray melee of course, otherwise I'll get raped, and then um, go down this ladder, obviously, and hopefully I don't get blocked, which I am, so I have to go around uh, the back here, and hopefully I just have to climb down there, and uh, I'm getting blocked once again. Come on, just let me in. Oh, there we go. Come on, straight around the back. And right here, and then we go down here, and uh, yeah. <clears throat> so we go over to this big wall of fire and use the bar straight on that, and I believe it should do its own thing. Hopefully, I didn't lose the bar. Use that with that, use that with that, come on, use it. And we are now have monkey speak amulets. Now we're gonna go back all the way back to just fucking try and run, which I can't because I'm stuck in here. Can I climb up here? Does it do anything? Um, still getting attacked, I believe. Uh, all this hassle, man, just for one freaking item. Um, so, I don't know where it's gone. Over here. And we still have to stay secretive, I believe, because I can't really... I keep getting poisoned and stuff, losing all my food. But uh, if I trade this guy here, can I... Remove this human. Please do not call the freaking guards over here. Oh, no, I need a... Oh. Okay, guys, so now just to sum a few things up, I want to say I cheated. I really did. Now, um, I made a gre monkey Grigory. Now, the only way I cheated was because I really couldn't be bothered to go to Karamaja and kill the monkeys to get monkey bones. So I used some for my bank that I did have. I believe there's another quest or something I was going to use them in. Um, so yeah, I use those monkey bones. So um, this is uh, an invalid item on the series. But hopefully it allows me to um, buy myself a scimitar. And hopefully you guys understand that I went through like two hours of pain just for this moment. So let's trade this guy and see what we got here. So come on. He doesn't even sell the freaking scimitars. This guy out here, what the hell? There we go. Four dragon skimmies, 100k, buy one. We got it. And let's quickly go somewhere so I can teleport before I die. And there we have it. Our new unstoppable dragon scimitar. After freaking hours and hours of work, we've acquired it. From scratch, boom, one hit men, just like a boss. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. We'll see you all next time. Uh, let's see what we're going to do with the scimitar on next episode. So, that was your cliffhanger for today. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Peace.